Lots of social scientists have done work thinking about the customer journey. That's the hat or the framework or the glasses that we need to put on to scrutinize what is that guest, what is that fan going through. So really simple, uh, what, what brands can do, what teams can do is program within that customer journey high points for them, their family, their guests, their children, moments that are shareable. If I say the word to you, interactive, you likely, because of your age, uh, maybe if you're younger in the spectrum, you might think that that's something digital, that that's something technology-based. But if you step back for a moment and you're philosophical and you hear the word interactive, what we really mean is that it's somehow engaging with us. It's multi-sensory. And we realize there's a spectrum of audiences. What we have to have is something that's interactive for each of those audiences, each of those age groups. So my most vivid example of that is an interactive piece that we did for Stanford at the Hall of Fame. If you go there, every letter man and woman is remembered by name by sport, by decade. And what you do is you go over to the bookshelf and you grab a tactile analog book and within that book contains all the men and women who played on a Stanford sport by year, by sport, by decade. And you can look in the book and you can find all of that information. But if you set the book down on this incredible table that we built, the whole table comes to life. And you can drill down to the sport, to the year, to the athlete to their Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram feed for 15,000 lettermen and women. So you choose, based on your age, your proclivities, your tendencies, how you want to interact with content, but it's all there and available for you. And it's captivating. We often think that interactive is just purely digital, or it's augmented reality, or virtual reality, and if you're not careful, the technology becomes more important than the story or what's being connected to. We have to give them something that's bespoke and authentic and curated. That's what they're expecting. 